Hello fellow gamers, I am your host Brent Justice and welcome back to my ju uh, gaming channel Justice Gaming. I am in One Far Cry 6 like again that. continuing my playthrough. Hope you all are having a blessed day today. I have a hot coffee in front of me today. Let me know what you're drinking in the comments below. Alright, in the last video we did several Yarin stories, completing the Yarin stories stuff. And I only have two left. I've got the Seeds of Love with Lorenzo Canseco and All the Blood, which is a DLC. So I'm going to wait till end game to do that one. But this one I do want to do. It's just hard to do because you have to go look for these photos. I can't even look at my photos while I'm in the city here or in our base. We can't do that. And I have no idea to even where to start with that with those photos. I looked at them already, but I don't know where to start with it. So I may end up having to look that one up. Like I may do that. I'm just letting you know ahead of time. I may look it up online to see where the spots are to go just so I can finish it because I have no clue where to start on my own. But let's go ahead and not do that today. Let's go ahead and take care of, of these rank sevens. I've got two rank eights, but let's start with these rank seven operations so in today's video we'll be continuing operations so i'm going to start with words like bullets from talia find a way to get me one-on-one -on -one with maria i've got something really special planned for maria a show she won't forget we need some facetime she's giving vivaro press tour and i need your help getting in and check up on tell on talia at camp maximus which I'm already here, so that works out real well. Anyone want to help me here? No? Let's see what... It's time to go face to face. Hello. We hit Maria's rum factory. We fucked up her billboards, and the bitch didn't even bat a fake eyelash. Meanwhile, Maximus Matanzas is dead, and I'm still stuck in this swamp. We've spilled real blood, Danny, and Marquesa doesn't even have a scratch on her. Fuck this. I'm gonna call out her bullshit right to her face. Uh -oh. Marquez is putting on a PR event, some kind of tour for foreign journalists. If you can get us passes, I'll give her a one-on-one -on -one performance in front of the whole world. Force them to hear the truth. Oh, well, it sounds like there may be music in this uh, episode. Yes, fuck up, Hopefully that won't be too bad. I'll have to cut it out if it is, though. You know how it is. All right, can we fast? We cannot fast travel here, and I've been to this place. I should be able to fast travel here, yeah. Well, I can, so I am. We need, let's see, steal some press passes. We need them to get into Maria's event. I'll look for them at her TV studio, which we've already taken over, so it's real nice. All I have to go. All I have to do is uh, come in here now because I've already taken over this entire place. So that helped out a lot. It's one of our bases. There we go. Let's do this shit. I should meet them in the parking lot at the Botanical Gardens of Yara. Meet Talia and Bicho way up here, huh? Song for that beach, so don't fuck this up. Easy, Talia. Keep it together, okay? Together, Danny. Don't lose those passes. Meet me and Bicho in the Botanical Gardens parking lot, and don't go in without us. I was gonna just fast travel to that area, but you know what? I may go for a drive. Or run into everything, either way. Yeah, let's go for a drive. Or we'll run right into that post. So I guess if we had not taken that base over, we would have had to uh, fight our way in there to get the passes. But having already taken over that military base was very good, then, or that radio TV station. 
I was able to just break right in. Not break in, but go with right in. And get what I needed. Boy, I am a terrible driver. Look at that sign go. Crap. This thing does not steer very well. Or right. It just does not steer well. Straight up hit me. Alright, we have to abandon. We have to abandon. Well, that was a mess. All because they ran into me. And let's be clear, they ran into me. Cool. She got him. Oh good, I got the uh, challenge updated. 3 of 24 for Rage of Ida. So yeah, I want her to, to take enemies out because she works on her uh, ranking her up with those abilities, right? So that's a good idea. Should I steal this guy's truck? I think I should steal this guy's truck. See you there, Casito. I made it out. It's all good. Crap. I flew out. Okay, here we go. What are we gonna have to do here? Cutscene, that's what we have to do. Here, you're a reporter now. Felicidades. Fuck yeah. This is Talia Benavides from Urban Garden. Coño, it's good enough. Take our stuff so we don't get shot. Let's change these clothes. Wait, aren't you? Silvio Balboa Garden City? Urban Garden? Can we move this along? Maria's waiting. She's like, sure you are. Sure you are. Gracias for traveling so far to learn about Viviro. The Castillo administration's pride and joy. Let us begin. The architecture. Impressive. All right. A lot of money not going to the rest of Yara. Today, I am honored and excited to share with you the miracle of Viviro, a revolutionary cancer treatment. Thirteen years ago, the brilliant biochemist... I just Dr. realized Gerlitz I'm not in my normal uniform, Yara, combat gear, have no any, I have no Supremo on me. It is Presidente I have nothing. Castillo's full support that allows us to produce this all-natural drug. Come, witness a breakthrough of innovation, generosity, and true Yaren spirit. Follow me. Mm -hmm. It's possible for the inside tour. You really make the reporter feel special. Anything for you, Nikolai. <laughs> it all starts with Nicotiana Yarana, our native tobacco plant grown in our western farmlands. Our tobacco is world famous for its unique flavor. Wondering what made it so unique, Dr. Reyes studied the plant. All right, looks like we're on a tour group. And I don't mean he smoked a lot of cigars. <laughs> and there's nothing I can do. I can't bring out any weapons. I can't access anything right now. I am stuck as I am. 
This way, my lovely people. I can interact with these, though. This interactive display will be available after or not. Ready for the next part of our Viviro adventure? Got guards here, but yeah, I cannot do anything, really. Hola. Dr. Reyes found that natural tobacco crops produced a limited amount of the compound. So, Where was she going? President Anton commissioned Yara's best minds to work with Dr. Reyes to design an all-natural fertilizer, PG-240. Spread on, like a hairspray, it uses gene therapy and nutrients to boost production of the compound. If you look, this tobacco has large red leaves. This is from the fertilizer. Beautiful, no? Puro, organico, e exotico. No? Sure. Would anyone like to spray the plants? Come, press this button. It is so much fun. <laughs> Should I come press the button? Excellent, a volunteer. Yeah, me. Let's press it. This is the beginning of the Viviro process. Using McKay to sidestep embargoes was considered quite controversial. Those critics only want to profit from cancer, from death. They see us as a threat, so they try to ruin us. This way, por favor. Okay, closer, closer. Get intimate. <laughs> I want you to hear me. This interactive display will be available after the presentation. Okay. In Central Yara, our finest scientists extract, refine, and package the cancer-fighting tobacco compound called Yarantin. Found only in Yaran tobacco. Dr. Reyes thinks Yarantin is why our cigars are so smooth. <laughs> Delicious and beneficial, no? I smoke one cigar a week and it keeps me skinny and strong. It's true. <laughs> okay, okay, if you say that's so. That's the tour. Our interactive stations are now available for you to enjoy. When you are ready, join me by the gate in the outdoor lounge for a surprise guest. There are rumors that farmers exposed cool. to PG240 are actually We got a little bit of a lesson there on how this works. By idiots. It's not true. Uh-huh. Right. I'm going to interact with the displays. I want to listen to them. So I'm going to I'm going to go interact with all of them. Bullshit. Mhm. Unfortunately. Okay. Yep, we saw that. Imagine this cube is Yara, a country rich in technology, agriculture, and spirit. One man combined these things, resulting in an explosion of innovation. In 2008, Dr. Edgar Reyes wondered why Yaran Tobacco was world famous for its unparalleled smooth flavor. His research led him to Yarantin, a phytochemical alkaloid unique to the plant. During tests, he discovered it stalled the growth of cancer cells. Yeah, I don't know about that. Uh -huh. In countries that recognize President Castillo's vision are receiving this treatment, which targets most known cancers. It gives individuals a new lease on life and allows Yara the noble pursuit of serving the planet. Gracias for watching this presentation on Viviro, the natural solution, a bio vida product. Right. I think there is some propaganda going on here.
by slaves. And keep Dusty on power. Essential to killing Yarans. Mm-hmm. One more. Soon after his initial discovery, Dr. Reyes created a new cancer fighting pharmaceutical product, Vivido. Fucking Vivido. Okay. I think we hit all the exhibits. I just want to make sure. Yeah. We hit them all. Okay. I did explore. Can we talk to these people? Stay with the group, por favor. Mm. I didn't think this could happen. I hear even more now than before. Okay, I did check them all out, so let's move on. This is really cool. We're like on a tour. And this ends our tour. But before we go, a surprise. Meet Dr. Edgar Reyes. The pioneer behind the Viviro. Dr. Reyes, thank Should you so I take much this? for making an appearance. Ah, muy bien. Okay, everyone. Enjoy the showroom and some of our finest Yaren Rome. Well, this I did take it. This is a preview of other Viviro products we are developing. Chewables, nasal sprays, vaginal suppositories. It is a... Uh, I say it. Sneak peek. So peek, peek away. <laughs> if you have a question, please email my assistant, Julio. <clears throat> Cutscene. I took the key. I don't know if I was supposed to or Come if I needed to, now. but Dr. I found Reyes, a key and I took it. Be late. Neither do we. Let's get in there. I told Bicho to leave our weapons back here. I hope you're ready to fuck shit up. Oh, okay, well. Take well. it as it comes. We got this. Stay on your toes. We're back. Confront Maria. Maria is giving an interview with Dr. Reyes. Talia has some words for her, but could I just go through here without killing people? I mean, could I sneak my way in? Or do I need to fight my way? I guess it says I'm trespassing and I'm in my combat armor, so they might shoot first. And she's got her weapon out, so. All right, we're gonna fight our way. Okay, so far so good. I got another key. Multiple keys, I don't know what all these are for. Are the enemies? It says there's red right through here. I guess, uh, could you explain why Yan says Vivido to some countries, but not all? Should I just start taking everybody out? Because this would be a good vantage point to do it, or should I not? Should I wait? I, mean, I guess I should. My weapons are already out. Hey, I got them all. Are the terroristas dead? What is going on? They did not get a shot off, guys. Is it safe? I want an update now. That was pretty sick, actually. I don't know what this does, but if there's things to do in a game, I should do it. So 
boring turn to this. I guess I'm flooding it with water. I don't know why that's important. Come on, grab it. Okay. Well, I'm. I got a greenhouse keycard item. It seems like there might be something in all this. I don't know. There's ladders. There's a reason to go down into the water. I don't know. There's something over there. Oh, it's going to go cutscene. Never mind. Oh, don't, don't shoot. I'm just a scientist. They just leave. Where that's it? Get shooting. True Yarens, welcome. We have a special program for you today. Maria Puta Marquesa, Minister of Culture, Uncle Anton's personal whore. You're also director to the True Yarn Academy, no? Where you fry people's brains to make sure they play nice? Like you did to me, right, Maria? What? Mm, don't play dumb, bitch! Talia, put the gun down. She's not worth it. You. You attacked my home. You put your filth on my network. You have any idea the embarrassment I had to endure because of your disgusting performance? I have given everything I am to be here. You think you can take that away from me? Ah, they're Where trying to have make her have multiple layers here. Fake yarns like you on that muddy macho you spread your perversions with. And where is she? Does she not approve of you playing with guns? Oh my gosh, she just straight up killed her. Oh, crap. Fuck. I don't know if that was warranted, but... Hey, let's go, let's go. That's what she did. She did it. That was pretty crazy. Get her the fuck out of here. Okay, well, I, I don't know if that was the... I don't know if that was the right answer. Probably not the right answer. But that's what happened. Okay. There was an item back in there I missed, though. But, oh well. Oh? I can't do it now. Yeah. That happened. I don't think he's too happy with us right now. Uh-oh, I hear music, or I don't hear music, but I, now, now I hear music. I'm going to talk over this, guys. I really am. I'm going to put, uh, I'm going to put my voice over this. I just have to do that. I apologize. But that was a pretty crazy scene. Um, pretty wild right there with all that. Can't believe she just straight up murdered her and not just killed her, not just shot her once, but like multiple times just kept going off, you know? And then I guess we destroyed the camera so that the camera would be destroyed. Although uh, they could probably still pull, pull, pull the footage from that. Now my question is, was that being aired? Was that live? Or was that just being recorded? Did other people see that? Because that does not put us in a good light, right? Just killing people like that. But then I say that, and I have been killing soldiers this entire time. I've been bopping them in the head with no, uh, no regard. You know, just killing everybody wherever I go, so. Oh, is that her? That's his mother, right? So, yeah, there's, there's, 
they were trying to make her a little more uh, multi-layered here, a little more complicated, and not so, not so one-sided, I guess, at the end. But uh, uh, that was interesting. Operation complete. Words like bullets. Plus three hundred on that. Hi. Military presence I increased. She's had her sights on her for a while now. I wonder if I can talk to her again. Talia. I don't know where she would be though. place is complicated. I just want to get around inside up here. Oh, come on. Bicho, you're not having a heart attack. How do you know? We need Paolo. Paolo knows how to fix this. Paolo's in Miami by now. No, 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 he's still here. Danny, come find me in the little mountain just west of the airport. There's a bunker, and I'll be the Mexican on top of it. Okay, okay, just take a breath. I'm on my way. Okay, I guess we are going to continue this mission then. So Talia ran off. I want to go to the uh, banditos here and turn anything with that in while I'm here. Ooh, these don't have a very high success rate. But I got it, I think. Claim reward. I got a treasure hunt from that. I got banditos. Did I get pesos? No. Okay. Okay, let's see where that leads. So... Operations. All right, so yeah, with Bicho here, maximum Matanzas mission rank seven. Paulo held us together, Danny. We need him back. Get Paulo back. He's down at at the airport, and he can fix everything. You just have to get past the soldiers and deal with Bimbe. I know you can do this. You can do this, right? Lost and found. Yeah, I believe we can do this. And I can get pretty close to where he's at, right here. Yeah, interesting mission. That was uh, laid out pretty well. Uh, a unique mission. It was uh, cat is your spirit animal. not just your standard fare. It had a lot of uh, it was interesting component to it going through that tour. Clara, Maria Marquesa is dead. I know. It's on the news everywhere. It wasn't the plan. Fuck. I don't think there ever was a plan. God damn it, Talia. Okay, Danny, you got a big target painted on your back. Nope. Watch, watch out, watch out, watch out. We need to regroup. No kidding. I'm working on it. Talk soon. No, I wanna meet Bicho first. We're gonna we're gonna take care of this. There again. I heard it again. Is he up there on that hill? He did say he was going to be on a mountain. I believe he is up here. Yep, here we go. Oh, 
that Radio Libertad would fix everything, but everything's fucked. Talia's doing some crazy shit. I haven't slept in days. I nothing's been right since Paolo left. My dealer swears he saw Paolo at the airport and he was with that fucker, Bembe. Danny, you can't let Paolo leave. He's the only thing that could put Talia back from the cliff, Cardinal. I even tried to get Paolo, got as far as the airport gate, and then boom, soldiers everywhere. Well, soldiers, I, I can take care of. I ran. You know I'm no good with soldiers, Danny. You got to get Paolo back. You got to make everything okay again. Well, that's what I do around here. Mm -hmm. I do a you lot of that. You have to do this on the download, Danny. There's a lot of soldiers down there. I can deal with it. All right, rescue Paolo. He was trying to leave when the army stormed the airport. I need to get to the terminal and find him. Oh, we're going to an airport, huh? Oh, and it's very close by. I can do that. Honestly. Oh, that's not that big. Not too big. So, we are going to take down everyone and everything here. Let's mess this place up, shall we? Oh, do I need to worry about an alarm, though? Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe I do. I don't know. Probably. I probably need to worry about an alarm, but I'm not going to. Haha. <laughs> -ha. Well, there was definitely an alarm. Well, there it was, so... Really? Took that many shots, huh? Should I just go ahead and blow this helicopter up? They may take off with it, right? Oh, I bet you there were two alarms. Okay. Well, we know what we have to do, right? I'm stuck. Nope, nope, nope. Lock on. Fire. One more time ought to do it. Okay, that's actually not too bad. There's a few more enemies. I don't know where. But let's go inside. He's in the building. No. How dare he be in the building? There's, like, one more person. I really want to get him. Oh, I have it on, uh... Shoot. Okay, that hasn't happened before. Or that doesn't happen often.
Okay, there's another helicopter. All right. Okay, now let's go in this place. Find security checklists, have all travel documents and access fees, no advance notice. <laughs> Got him. Got a card. And here's the lock. A simple request, really. Just a first class ticket to Mexico City connecting to Miami. A client of mine has paid his debt and is free to spread his wings. You do this for me. Your mother can see a doctor in Esperanza. No more Segunda clinics. No more waiting. Her cancer certainly isn't. Hola, Rojas. I'd like to think you're here to see your dear friend Bembe. But we both know you're after Paolo. Where is he? He's supposed to be on a first-class flight to Miami right now. But you sold him out. No, no, no. This was one of life's rare surprises. Soldados were waiting for me, Rojas. So I struck a deal. So that's when you sold him out? I traded for my freedom and kickbacks. But I'm not heartless. I will tell you where they took him. Paolo's in a resort in Barrial. A resort? done anything to him. We're going I'm to a resort. You. Promises, promises. If I were you, I'd hurry, Ross. Paolo's not in the safest of hands. Okay. All right. Find Paolo. El Doctor took Paolo to a resort, but which one? Oh crap! There's three of them. So I have to search each one and try to find him. Oh, and he's probably at the last one I search, right? Well, at least I cleared this place out. And it's nighttime now, so that's better. Oh, there were two alarms. There were two alarms. One, two, yeah, there oh, maybe three. There were definitely multiple alarms. All right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take this helicopter out because it's going to get in my way. I see guys coming after me. I'm going to get this helicopter. Too far away. <laughs> okay, who's shooting me? I, is it another? Oh, it's a plane. Air support. Oh, I got him. Oh, that was a good hit. The reason why I wanted the reason why I wanted to do that is because I want to take the helicopter, and that other one was going to get in my way. So that's how I deal with that. Right into that. Hey, Bicho. You got Paolo. You're a real young hero. Shut up for a second. He's been captured. They took him to a fucking resort. W a resort? W what does that mean? Is Paolo okay? Is it a nice resort? Bicho. I'll call you when I have him, okay? Yeah, I don't know which one to start with, so I'm gonna start with the closest one, which is right in front of me. 
But I assume I have to search all of them. And this was definitely the best way to get there. I think back there I saw a uh, crate as well in the tower, but I can come back and get it at another time. We're going to land right here. All right. Why would they take Paolo to a place like this? Let's go in and see what we find. I miss. Paolo, are weird. you here? Okay, now let's search Paolo. this place. Paolo, Paolo's not here. Fuck. Maybe upstairs. No, it's he just said Paolo's not here. So yeah, I'm gonna have to go to all of these places, aren't I? Well, let's search the back side while I'm here. There's a crate somewhere nearby. I'm gonna grab the loot that's over here real quick. Monday, waterfall hike. Tuesday, catamaran excursion. Wednesday, rum distillery tours. Thursday, trivia night. Friday, cocktail lounge party. Saturday, rum rumba dance contest. And Sunday, live at jazz. There, it said there was a crate somewhere. Uh, this way. Somewhere over this wall. Well, I don't know how to get in there. Well, probably the door. That would be how you get in there. Ah, uh, really? Ooh, okay, there's a weapon in there. There's something in there. I mean, yeah. Why wouldn't I just do this? <laughs> and grab it. An impact driver. I'll have to check that out. Don't know what that's all about. All right, let's just walk to the next one. There's a freaking tank. I'm gonna stay away from that. All right, here we come up on this one. Paolo better be here, or Bembe's a dead man. I have a feeling he's not here. Also, how do I get into this place? It's walled up. Special forces, gone. Special forces, no longer special.
Okay. I have a feeling he's probably not in here. Paolo, it's Danny. Paolo. I like how we're just yelling. We're screaming. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe he Paolo. isn't. Maybe he isn't here. Oh, maybe we did find him. I thought it would be the last one. Oh, no. How, how did I not see that coming? Seriously, how did I not see that coming? Come on, that was terrible. Totally got caught just like that. Oh, come on. I love these new phones. They're so thin. Well, now I'm being tortured. Yeah, I learned that from Castillo. Look at Bibero. He would have gone nowhere if I hadn't created the outcast camps. You know, orphans like you make the best death subjects. Along with the poor. Anyone on the fringe of society. Crap. Now I'm gonna have to overcome some kind of medical induced issue. What you call the problem. I'm gonna be poisoned. Bumped into your bloodstream. I'm gonna have to do something to overcome the poison. Oh crap. Wakey wakey, Danny. Me, motherfuckers. So does he have a kill switch now for me? Like he can take me out whenever he wants. Uh, he put something in me. Oh God! He put something in me. No! Did she, is she dead? What? Fucking go! Oh, okay, okay. Is she shot in the neck? Because she would be dead if she shot in the neck. What? Okay, so many things are happening right now. She just got shot, and I'm. I'm pumped full of drugs. Oh, Matias! Need your help. Danny, I can't talk right now. I got Paolo on the way with Talia. He was fucking hell, doctor! He poisoned me! Need to get it out! Okay, you need to get to my clinic on your own. Take the road north. It's a straight shot to me. Got it, Danny? Yeah, I'm Danny. not gonna worry about, uh... Oh crap, I'm blacking out. I I'm not gonna worry about looting anything. I'm just gonna head straight there. A car. Need a car. I don't think I should be driving. I don't think I should be. Oh, is he? I have to get the Matias. Why is he in the car with me? Should I have shot him? Danny, please take a moment and for science. Uh, let me see where I'm headed. Also. I mean, how you feel? You're not real. By now. The PG-240 has worked its way past the blood-brain barrier. Shut up! Your neurons are firing randomly as they shut down. Your subconscious is taking over. Shut the fuck up! Oh, this is trippy. I have one request. Please leave your body in one piece for the autopsy. So he was not in the car with me. I thought he was really there. I was like, why is he in the passenger seat? Why is he coming with me? Uh, uh, oh, fuck. oh, this is fuck about Libertad or so trippy it's right like now. Guns. Lita. No, this is a real. Don't you get it? I never should have been on that boat, Danny. You put me there. We had to leave. Castillo was rounding up everyone. No, Danny. They were coming for you. I should have been with Clara, but I came to the city to say goodbye to you. Uh, how was I supposed to know? You took my place in Libertad. You just left my body rotting on the beach. It should have been you. Uh, I'm sorry! You had to be the lucky one. How does it feel? <sighs> Well, this is really disorienting. Really disorienting. Don't do this. Uh, no, no, no. Wait a 
Stefanos Body Shop? That oh. was your big American dream? Everybody's coming to talk That's to me. Terrible. The Solberg Body Shop has such a better ring to it. Alejo? Do you know what Weird Fano says to me? He screams, pity fuck you. I was supposed to be drowning in Yankee pussy. You weren't supposed to die. It all happened so fast. I wasn't supposed to die. Is that all you have to say to me, Dan? You left my fucking corpse on that rooftop. They were going to kill us, too. Did I go the wrong way? Alejo. No, Please. I'm going this way. After the bullet went into my brain, I could still see. I lived just long enough to watch you and Lita leave me behind. I feel. Did I make it? That was disorientating. Danny, you're next. Paolo, keep her steady. Everybody. Oh, yeah, she got shot in the neck. How do you survive that? Not like this. Not like this. We're supposed to be together, remember? Danny, what are you doing? Danny! Listen to me, Danny. Drop the knife! What did I just do? Oh, the cell phone was inside me. And it had the poison inside. Ah, oh, that's what he put inside him. Oh my gosh. That was wild. That was wild. You're both lucky you have the best doctor in Yara. Where's Paolo? Just outside. Said he had a war to plan. Fuck. Now cut yourself open again, and I am not putting you back together. What a crazy set of operations here I've done today. Some really big things have happened. I guess we're okay though. Operation complete. Lost and found. Ooh. Talk to Qu uh, Apollo. He is at the clinic. Well, aren't I here at the clinic? Yeah, down here. Okay. Danny, come here. Oh, he's got another crazy. mission for me. Screaming about Bembe. Blaming him for what happened to you, me, and Talia. Last night, he took off while we were sleeping. I think the idiot's gone after Bembe. Don't know how Bicho thinks he's going to track him down. Bicho always had our back. And we never... Just find the little shit. Okay? We're going to war. I need to oh. rally our people. War, huh? That means no one gets left behind. Even Bicho. Well, of course, I'm going to do it. At Intervention. Stage, every what a crazy counts. set of missions, honestly. I mean, Maria, gone. I was drugged. She was shot in the neck. Jeez. Okay, there is something here. Oh, just that. And I guess we can't go inside the place now. Okay, we can't go inside. Yeah, that was pretty wild. I liked it though, but pretty wild. Let's see what we are going to do now. I guess that's everything around here. There's a workshop here. I don't really need it though. Okay, so I need to travel. Where am I traveling now? And it put me way up here too. Where am I traveling? Oh, Novantarmus, and I have been here, of course. Well, we can go real fast to here, so let's do that. Fast travel. This is still a rank 7 mission, so I'm going to continue it. Continue on this path. How are you? That way. We'll take a vehicle. And 
I'm going here. Uh, there's a convoy, but I'm not going to worry about it. Oh, we're cutting... No, we're not cutting through there. Where... Where are we cutting through? Right here? Okay. This way. Here we go. Bicho! Bicho! You crazy come mierda. Where are you? Yeah, really. Don't know why I'm re writing this. I guess things are going okay for once and that's weird for me. Yeah, I think I have read that before. This is Bicho's place, ah, right? He's not here. Maybe he left something lying around that will tell me where he went. Probably this letter that's flashing. Bicho, I came through for you, eh? We gotta stick together in this country asking for a gun. You surprised me, but I got it for you and enough bullets to make you famous. Here's the other part of the favor. Bimbe's playing everybody, especially the F&D. You'll find one juicy piece of his game at Lacanzo Rodeo and Auction. So, Bimbe's buying weapons from the military. Looks like the handoff was at the Rodeo. I have one piece, one of the pieces already. I guess I've been there and discovered something. Yeah, all, in all my looting and time that I spend around doing all that, um, I've already completed half of this mission. That's fun. So is it here I need to find something? Bicho went, let's see, I'll check out Bicho's place. Search El Rancho Bicho. So somewhere around here, there's got to be something else to find. Oh, why does this smell? Oh, it's leading me right to it. The Castile regime can do nothing but fail the people of Yara. An electric dam meant no to provide power for the powerless sounds ideal, idyllic even. It should come as no surprise that mismanagement has turned a, necess a necessary utility for the poor of Yara into a cesspit of corruption and an environmental catastrophe. Libertad guarantees power to the people and for the people. Such failures must stop with Anton. The levy must break and the Castile regime must end. Viva Libertad. All right, the other piece, Bembe skims his vivero right from the factory, even has the workers pack the trucks for him. You want to mess with him? He's got a guy at the Novan Tarmus plant. I'd never I'd never stand in your way, not after that stuff you pulled from me, but whatever you're thinking, stop. Give me some vivero off the top, huh, Bembe? I should check that warehouse. I've probably been there. If I find Bembe, I find Bicho. Be alive, mi socio. All right, I searched. Bicho went to the rodeo Oye, to crash Bimbe's weapon I think deal. I Bicho's done something stupid. What's he done this time? He's really going after Bimbe. Stupid come mierda. Don't worry. I'll find him before he digs himself too deep. Hurry, Danny. Bicho's no match for someone like Bimbe. So I need to search Sol Del Pina processing facility. Looks like Bimbe was stealing BioVita supplies. Okay, where is this at. Oh, I have not been here. Alright, so I will be going here for the first time. Wait, there's two places? Oh, I have been here. Oh, there's two places. Look at that go. So 
So right through there, huh? Investigate. I need to look for something that will help me find Bimbe. Alright, are there any guys here? I don't see any guys. No enemies. There is a cache somewhere here. Oh, there's a dead body. I wonder if that's something. Oh, here we go. Cash. Set the bulls loose on everyone. What a way to go. Oh, are they gonna? Are they gonna? Are they gonna? They're gonna. They're gonna. I have to blow them away, or they're gonna blow me away. I didn't have a choice. They were gonna take me out. The handoff is scheduled for Friday at the rodeo. I don't trust him. He's a snake. We've tracked him to Rendon State. Intel suggested his family's ancestral home. I've asked Rodriguez to stand by with a detachment of surrounding the place if he tries then they anything. And killed his buyer. Bicho must have followed him out. Paolo, the little maniac sabotaged one of Bembe's black market deals. Let the bulls loose as some kind of rodeo. Repinga, he's going to get himself killed. I won't let anything happen to him. Oh. Okay, voila. Can I help this person? They are bleeding to death. I wish I could... I, if I could heal them, I would, but I, I have no way to heal them. I don't know. I can't do anything. I, I cannot help this person. Ah! <laughs> Well, I can't. I shouldn't do that. Probably. Oh, repair tool does not repel, repair humans. Note to self. Repair tool does not heal humans. Okay, this one is pretty far. Is my vehicle still out here somewhere? So, looks like Bimbe was stealing BioVita supplies. Search Sol Delpina Processing Facility. Is that it? No, it's far away. Farther away. See where this leads. A nice drive across Yara at night or dusk into night. Is that it? I think this is the place. Yeah. Ooh. There's a, uh, somebody needs help up there. I'm going to do this. Gracias, gracias. 
At least I can, at least I can help that person, right? At least I can help that person. All right, we gotta go. We gotta break into this place. So let's do it. Did not box the situation. Shit. Oh, you little help. I did, I helped. The one stealing Bibiro. I think he's still inside. All right, I need to look inside the warehouse for Enrique. Oh, shoot. The helicopter. Oh, he's way over I'm here. Around. Don't shoot. Easy. Just tell me. A crazy kid come through here. Talks a lot. Hair kind of like a pineapple. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Hair like a pineapple. Came in here whiffing a gun around. Told me I had to tell him where my buyer lives. Guy called Bembe. Did you tell him? See, si. And then the kid ran off. Can you tell me where Bembe lives? <sighs> Nobody knows exactly where his place is. But it's in Cruz del Salvador. Near the border. That's all I know. I swear. Please. Just let me go. Paolo. I know where to find Bembe. Then that's where Bicho will be. Exactly. Sit tight, Paolo. Um, before I leave this place, though, absolutely I'm gonna search around. We have to look everywhere. For that stuff. Let me look on the map here. Yeah, there is a crate. There's a crate somewhere. Let's go to the roof since we're up here. Might be on the roof. No, not on the roof. I don't know what just blew up, but I don't want to know. <laughs> I didn't do it, that's all I know. Somebody else did it. There's the crate. Okay, I think I got everything in this area. Oh, we didn't go into that building. Let's check it out. I don't think we can go in it. There's a lot of buildings you can't go inside in this game. Okay, yeah, I think that takes care of everything. Let's get back on my vehicle and I will go to the next spot. Go to get to Bicho. He went to Bimbe's villa to confront him. So that would be here.
This way. like up there, huh? How do I get up there? Where's the map taking me? Oh, it's taking me around. Oh, there is a, a road around. Around to it. Well, I'm definitely in the right vehicle for this. Heard about this. Looks like Benbei hides out in an old slave shack on a plantation. Okay. That's Bicho's truck. Bicho! Bicho! There's also a uh, crate over here somewhere. Uh, up there, maybe? Cutscene. Pichu, what the fuck? Get out of here, Daddy! I'm gonna blow this cabron's head off. No, you're not. Oh, I'm not? You don't think I will? Huh? Man, this got serious oh, real fast. Me. You thought coming here was gonna fix it all. But it's not going according to plan, is it? What the fuck do you know, eh? I know you're no killer. Look at you shaking. You're a frightened little rat. A pest. A parasite. Yes. You take and give nothing back. Bicho, don't listen to him. That's right. Bicho, just a blood-sucking bug. Wow. Whoa, whoa, no. whoa. No. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're not a bug, man. You're not Bicho. What's the real fucking name? You wanna fix something? Pull that trigger. You need to shut the fuck up right now! My name's Bass. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You're Bass. Your name is Bass. You're not Bicho, man. You're not a bug. You're Bass. And I need you with us, okay? Wow. Turn serious fast. You're a piece of shit. At least I don't lie to my friends. Not that it matters. But I tried to get Palo up. I really did. Okay. Interesting. Operation completed. Intervention. Intelligence gathered from sources say that local guerrillas have been successfully conducting surveillance on our supply to counter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seen that a million times. Hey, Paolo. Danny, tell me Beach was okay. See, si. Dr. Marov doing something really stupid. He's a bit shook, but he's okay. Oh, fuck. Thank God. And Bembe? Still alive. Still a snake. Shit. I was hoping you wouldn't say that. There's always going to be a Bembe, Paolo. But there aren't many Bichos out there. When Bicho gets back, maybe tell him how you feel, yeah? He could use it right now. I will. I promise. Thank you, Danny. Mm-hmm. Danny, how is my patient? Alive. Gracias. I am alive. And I have another cool scar to show my friends. You joke, Danny. But it's the scars in your head that worry me most. Look, it's not a good situation here. Talia has an infection and we're low on medication. Oh. I'm sure Castillo has some to spare. You and I think alike. Hit these three checkpoints along the road west of my clinic. Hurry, Danny. Talia's life depends on it. Oh, now I have to do, uh, I have to find some medicine for her, huh? I mean, she was shot in the neck. Come on. There were nearby military checkpoints with the antibiotics. Oh, I think I've been to these checkpoints. Probably. I've been to one. And there are two more checkpoints. Oh, that's a fun mission. I like that. 
I'll do that in the next video, but let's hit up these here. The Castile Regime can do nothing but fail the people of Yara. An electric damage to provide... Oh, I've, I've read that one. Some soldados let it slip that they're expecting a military supply drop nearby. You'll have to race to get there on time. Yeah, probably one I've done already. Sir Alvarez, this is your last notice. Your land has been requested by the government for the betterment of Yara. You and your family must relocate. Your plantation will be developed. Mm -hmm. An amount of money is offered. You need to take it. Okay. Yes, Bimbe's secrets. And I see that there's something, something to get somewhere. A crate. Where did it go? Do you think it's up? I see alligators. Well, that's never a good sign. Like when I'm in here, when I'm in here, it looks like it's underground. It's underneath. Oh, there is a secret hatch. Oh, well, I didn't see that. Nice. So we'll take that. We'll take this. We'll see what it is. Just that. We'll take that. We'll take that. We'll take that. And that. Oh, this is really cool. Oh, nice. It's like a, a secret exit. Whee, into the water. What a fun series of missions that was. Now it says I do need to go get these antibiotics. And we're definitely going to do that in the next series of missions. I just wanted to look if there's any other crates nearby. Now I got all the, if there was any in this facility and there's not. So I got all the crates around there. I'm going to go back to this hideout here because in the next video we're going to go up there and do that stuff. How far away is that? That's not too far. Oh, I could travel here though. That'd be even closer. That's where I'll stop today. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's talk about... Let's talk What's about up? that. So... In today's video, oh, she's talking. I can't hear myself talk. All right, so, well, let's look at the beautiful city there. Um, wow, first of all, Martina, gone, and that's her, his mother. I mean, she's just straight up murdered by Talia. I mean, like, a lot. That was pretty incredible. Um, big storyline moment there. Uh, Talia got shot in the neck. I was poisoned. Had a trippy experience getting some help. Then we had to uh, have this Bicho and Bimbe situation at the end. Wow. And that was intense. So this whole video today has been very intense. These missions were very intense today. But I feel like we have made progress. And I wanted to see... Now the next one is still a rank 7 mission and we will start that one next. We'll do surgical extraction in the next video. And then after that we're working up to like rank rank 8 missions, which is nice. Yeah. So that's cool. Yeah, I'm liking uh, where this is going so far and I do wonder how much this has progressed me in the game so far. I still have all these to follow too and I will get to those, but I'm going to do rank 7 first then get to rank 8. I'm kind of going in order. So, yeah. There you go, everybody. Uh, enjoying the game, and I hope you all are having a good time as well. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned for the next one.